Old Trafford was the venue for the latest annual Soccer Aid match on Sunday, June 11, but co-founder Robbie Williams was once again not playing as the World Eleven beat England 4-2. Singer Williams created the charity event with friend Jonathan Wilkes in 2006, which sees a team of England footballing legends and celebrities take on a rest of the world side. The aim of the special match is to raise money in aid of UNICEF UK, with more than £75 million being garnered over the years, with another £15 million to add to the total from Sunday's occasion. Williams often donned his boots, playing in many of the early events when it was held biannually. But Tage looks to have finally caught up with the 49-year-old as he hasn't figured on the pitch, in a playing capacity, since 2016, and even that was just for the final few minutes as a sub. He did sing his hit Angels at halftime at West Ham's London Stadium last year, but the event went ahead without his presence on the pitch. World XI captain and Olympic legend Usain Bolt opened the scoring on Sunday to put his side 1-0 hip at the break, but sex education star Asa Butterfield restored parity early in the second half. Minutes later, former Manchester United player Paul Scholes scored for England to put them in the driving seat, before needing treatment on the pitch. Don't miss! Tory party tearing itself apart as MPs panic that Boris is sinking the ship, latest, but former Republic of Ireland captain Robbie Keane then grabbed the spotlight, bagging the second and third goals for the World XI, before Love Island's Kem Setne made it 4-2, with the commentators revealing he is now the all-time top goalscorer in Soccer Aid history. Also appearing for the World XI were comedian, Lee Mack, Brazilian ace Roberto Carlos, former Italy star Francesco Totti and football commentator Darren Fletcher. Ahead of the match, rapper Stormzy, who was part of England's management team, sounded confident, saying, We just need to bring it home, that's the main thing. The Grime star added that his team should end its losing streak the day. Sadly for him, it was despair once more for the home side, 